So guys, well, to my Nigerians, you all know my name, um, uh, uh, Omas. Um, some people call me Augusta, which is my English name. That's fine. And here in the United States, my workplace, they call me Shaka. That's fine. They are all my names. There's no big deal about it. But there's something I want to get straight to everyone. Whether you're here in the United States, whether you're here back home in Nigeria, whether you was, whether you were once my classmates in the university, I just want to get one thing straight. If you are in the position to help the widows, if you are in the position to help the old people, if you are in the position to help the orphan, please do it. Do it. Because there is a great reward. There is a big reward if you can help the weak. If you want to get more details about the blessing that goes along with helping the widows, helping the old people, helping the orphanage people, go to Psalm 41 and read Psalm 41 and see the huge blessings that God has in stock for people who look out for the weak, for the poor. If you want me to give you another scripture again, go to Psalm 39, verse 6, or Psalm, yes, Psalm 39, verse 6. Go read Psalm 39, 6. But the one that I'm really, really big about, go and read Psalm 41 and see what it says. If you can buy a hair of 65,000 naira, Look at me. Look at me. Wearing short cords. I can buy the hair. Like, if I want to order the hair today, I will order the hair today. But I look at, I. there are some things that I, I, I value in my life that gives me joy. is those old ones. The old ones that cannot pay you back. They can pay you back. If you know the huge blessing for old people that can't work anymore, but you are there to be their legs. If you know the profit to be the voice of the orphans. If you know the profit to be a husband to the widows. See. Just go and read Psalm 41. And go and read Psalm 39.6. You will know what I'm talking about. I'll give you a short story. I came to this country, right? I came to the United States. And I was struggling with my citizenship. You know what the Lord said? Look for the orphan. Look for the widows and look for the old people that can't pay you back and give them what you have. And I'm like, God, if this is my own voice, I'm not going to obey. You have to give me a scripture that says that I should give to the widow, give to the old people, and give to the orphans. So the the Holy Spirit, look, the Holy Spirit is very, very intelligent. You don't, you can't play games with the Holy Spirit. If He instructs you and you're arguing, to give, He will tell, He will put you straight. He gave me a scripture where Job fed the poor, fed the widow, fed the orphan. 
Do you know that all those things is the secret of Job well? Job was the richest man in the East. Go and read the story of Job. I am telling you today that if you have 200,000, if you have 50,000 in your account and you take 30,000 or 25,000 to go and buy a stupid hair and put it on your head, put it on your own head, and you have one old woman in your backyard that just need one basket of Gary and you can afford that, you are the most stupid person on earth. And a time is coming where you will get old like that old woman. You will see nobody to attend to you. Because the Bible said, blessed. It said, give and it shall be given unto you. Don't let calamity cash on you. You may ask me, what have I done? I don't put my videos out. If you want me to put my video out, I'll put it out. Just tell me, hey, Shaka, I need you to put one of the video of what you what you what you did to some of the orphan. I'll put it out. If you want me to send it to you privately, I will send it to you privately. In Orugun there, in Wari there, my old people, my 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 I hate old I hate old people. I hate them. The orphans, I hate them. The widows. Oh my goodness. I hurt them. I can't stand the widows being hungry and crying. I can't stand the old one looking at their tiny eyes. Don't have anything to eat. I can't stand the orphan can't pay their school fees. I can't stand it. I am telling you because if you have any old person in your area, your backyard, anywhere in your community, that you know that you can assist with just ten dollars or with just one basket of gary one basket of beans one basket of of rice try there's a huge reward well i don't want to take much of your time but more video will be coming because giving is what brought me this far After this video, if you really want to know how I got to United States, who gave me the money, how the money came, I will post the video one day for you to get motivated and for you to fear this God. Because the Bible said it is blessed to give than to receive. If you want, I will post the video one day and you will see how God opened the heaven that brought me to United States. And that blessing has not stopped. That giving opened up my destiny that I'm still enjoying today. So my people, 1,000 Naira is not too small. $10 is not too small to reach out to the old, to the widow, and to the orphan. I love you guys. But Jesus loves you more. Thank you. Bye.